the aim of the programme is to make museums as innovative and resilient as they possibly can be. There's a whole range of very general training that we do, uh, which is designed to reach all staff and volunteers, ranging from training on customer care, through to how to look after your collections well, how to develop your audiences, how to get more information about the people who are visiting you. So working with museum development officers is incredibly important as that provides so much professional support and professional training for my team and also for volunteers. And through museum development officers and through the training that they offer, we have a real diversity of things that have been offered there, um, collections development training, collections cleaning, various retail training that was offered and all of this is for free which is incredible and we just simply wouldn't have access to any of this if it wasn't available through this scheme. There's a big role for bigger museums like Museum of London in terms of skill sharing. We already do a lot with the Regional Collections Care Development Team at the Museum of London to share skills on collections care and conservation. Prior to the museum's redevelopment, the collections were really not in brilliant order. So a lot of work has needed to be done to bring them up to a standard that reflects how lovely the galleries are. We've had some fantastic feedback on, on the training. Over 90% are very satisfied and very pleased with the training that they've been on. But perhaps even more important, since they've been on the training with us, they've been able to put that learning into practice. We're getting to a stage now where um, rather than perhaps wanting to shy away from showing people our collection stores and how things are looked after, we're now very happy to um, show people what we're doing.